Hey, it's Tuxedo Mark. It just turned 8 15 p.m. on uh, Tuesday, October 19, 2021. And I'm going to be doing some more live streaming of um, Legend of the Ghost Line on the NES. So. Okay, uh, let's open up the emulator. And, um, and load the save state. Alright. So now that I know where the town is, let's, uh, I could easily go back for a refill whenever I need it. It's just in that little mushroom thing right there. So, uh,. So, what was the B dagger? Huh. Doesn't seem to do much good. Let's, uh, let's call a spirit. The spirit. <laughs> That's, uh, is that the cave I came from? Probably. Um, calling him on these spears, I mean, it costs you dreams, but. They can help you in battle. Sometimes they'll absorb the attack instead of you. And their their hit points or whatever are restored every time that you call them, even during the same battle, from what I've read. So uh there's that. Wander around here. Oh, let's go down into this. Uh, <laughs> Many demons here. Oh, it's just a skeleton and a song. All right, let's uh, let's find. Them. It's too bad that you can't fight as well during the same turn. It's like, oh, there's, you're allowed only one attack during each turn. I feel like if you've called upon a spirit, you should be able to attack, and they should be able to attack. Oh, you can, but I guess you have to have Maria join in the fight too, or something. I don't know. And then... Okay. Alright, so let's uh, explore down in this 
basement, I guess? Oh, let's see, here's the chest. Oh. Okay. Let's see, Mojo's power is always the same. So you might as well just use... Is that a him or her? I'm not sure. But it seems when you when you call upon a spirit, you can't attack during that same turn because calling uses up your turn or uses up Marie's turn. Basically. Feed us the treasure is yours. Oh, okay. Try that again. This must be like an abandoned city, right? I'm gonna try to run from these other battles. Because, yeah, I get. Oh, the enemy chase. So, running, if the enemy chases after you, they automatically get first hit against you. It's a city with the basement thing in it. Alright. See, here's the problem. I don't have enough courage to survive all these random encounters. I can try to run away, but... Oh. It says I escaped, but then the enemy chases out. I need to build up my 
hope so all of my stats can increase. See, I lost a bunch of rubies. That's all that you lose, though. You get to keep your weapons. So if I'm, all that I'm doing is losing money, I can always build it back up later. Um, it's not really necessary to have it right now. I could always build it up in minor battles later on. Close to the fairies or whatever they are. At least in this game, it says that the enemies appear. I'm not sure if they say that in Bard's Tale or not, because otherwise... Uh, how does this Maria not, like... Because, like, in the Bard's Tale, I'm not sure if, it's, if it says the enemies appear or not. And if it doesn't say they appear, then how does the party not notice that? At least until they're right upon them. Not sure how long I'm gonna play the game tonight because I actually want to watch the movie. And yes, there is a movie that, as I mentioned before, this game is based on an obscure movie. And it is on YouTube, actually. Someone copied it from the uh, VHS. Someone transferred it from VHS, I mean, and put it on YouTube. Um, so I'm excited to watch it. Mojo's power is restored every time that you summon him. I think it's a guy, yeah. You see, sometimes the spirits can absorb your attacks, absorb the enemy's attacks, which protects. Um, Maria's courage from being depleted um, 
too quickly. You received a fragment of hope. Oh, cool. Hope is now four. Purchase. Now 39, dreams are now 35. Okay, let's save in the emulator. Um, we can't go that way. It's on. Um, that is odd. Weird. Huh. Okay. Well, back up we go. Maybe there's another... Oh, yeah, there's another thing. Oh, come on. So this must be like some kind of haunted town with these werewolves in it. I meant to call. I meant to call. Fine. At least you can back out of the force. Oh, Mocha got a power upgrade too by four points. Oh. Okay. Uh, and sometimes Marie does get the uh, that you can after she summons the spirit. Oh, come, seriously? Twice in a row? This is getting kind of ridiculous. Successfully escape from an enemy in this game. Oh, that's it. I, uh. Alright. Let's see. Just 101 rupees. Alright. Let's, uh. No, I already have that. But I guess you should do it anyway, just to be able to save your progress, because I don't know if it auto-saves um, when you get sent back to the spring or not. But let's save it in the emulator as well. Now let's go back to that castle or whatever and check out the other staircase. with a club. Okay. There doesn't seem to be any indi 
any pattern to like whether you get the first hit in or the enemy does. At least in the Bard's Tale, it tells you that your party is unprepared or whatever. How do I get in there? Too bad that Marie doesn't have the option to defend. And we'll just let Moja do the work because if Marie could defend herself, maybe she wouldn't lose as much courage. I'm trying to figure out how to get to that other staircase. Oh, maybe like this? What's this? Search around your feet, but there was nothing. So, what? It's just decoration? But uh, did that say a magic in the uh, Probably like a batter, like a maze or something that you have to. Uh, Save an emulator. Okay, do I really want to explore that other thing right now, or let's explore somewhere else on the map? Maybe there's something else to see. Might as well just fight because I don't think there's any chance of running away successfully. Um, what? Uh,
don't know if there's... I don't know if uh, the more cards that you get that your that um, your attacks will hit more and their attacks will hit you less. I'm not sure if the game takes that into account. Small needle prick Marie. Twelve courage points are taken. Really? From a needle prick? What's uh, down here? Look in there. Don't know if there's There's a treasure chest, but apparently I went the wrong way to get it. Let's see what's up. Found red ring. Okay, what's the red ring do? Let's go over here. Here's another one. Oh, cool! A fragment of hope. All right. Courage now fifty-eight. Cream smile forty-two. Hurt is not 50. Wow, that was a big boost. Okay. That's where I came in.
I think what's more important in this game is to get the items. As long as you can get the items, that's uh, that's the main thing. I think the rubies. You can always grind for money later on. I mean, losing half of your rubies um, when you die, so to speak, even though you don't really die, you lose all of your courage. That's probably not as important. I mean, it affects how soon that you can buy items in shop, but... Alright, here's another chest. Rapier. Some kind of weapon. Me? I don't know. Apparently not. takes less damage from the packs. So courage is like hit points, but uh, I guess uh, your so-called armor, even though you don't really have armor, um, increases so you take less damage. Alright, um, let's get back to the spring, or the berries, or whatever, I keep saying spring, it doesn't look like spring, but let's get back there and save our progress. We've made some progress. I might have to look at a fact later to see what all of these items do. Save the save state. Um, what else is there to oh get attacked right away? You dead. That goes back to where I was before.
Now that I've leveled up in hope, should I, uh, attempt that other cave in the abandoned town again? Try that, I suppose. Oh, Rapier is, uh... There's a Spirit of a Red Ring and a Spirit of a Rapier. I wonder what all of those do. Let's try a Red Ring. Half Wing, the Spirit of Red Ring here, okay? Huh, the first option is to defend instead of fight. That's interesting. Is that the halfling's way to defend? Well, I'm gonna have him fight anyway for her. Not very effective. Alright. Gonna call the rapier. Let's see what happens. Elf, the spirit of the rapier. Let's have the halfling defend. And elf use magic, dark magic, or dark's magic. However, the magic didn't affect the skeleton. However, the magic didn't affect the zombie. Okay, that was useless. <laughs> Halfling is protecting only Maria. Still let me get hit. Let's call Mocha back. Okay, I got two spirits protecting me. I better not get... And I got hit again. Oh, there's that at least. That. Uh, if it'll let me, at least we got only one skeleton now.
I wish I got eight power points from that last hope fragment. some progress I leveled up a bit um, twice actually I believe and so uh, in my next session I'll try that cave again underneath the abandoned town and see what's in there but I think I'm gonna read a fact on the game Coco don't script don't script. Don't hold on too tight, you're scratching. And, uh, yeah, and I'm going to watch the movie. So, I'll, I'll do a review on the movie. Um, I don't know if I'll do it today or tomorrow, but we'll see. Um, but anyway, that's it. It's uh, 8.59 p.m., and uh, thanks for watching.